Translational research is a process that has enabled us to get uh, biological insights, which in turn allow us to make a lot of progress in uh, finding new treatments and optimizing existing treatments for cancer patients. SPECTA includes all the processes needed for deploying translational research in a multinational setting in Europe. Such processes include an informed consent that allow us to test material and produce results far into the future, processes to collect, handle, process and distribute biological material for testing, and of course processes to deploy this testing and distribute the results, including molecular review boards and advice to all concerned partners of the projects uh, working on SPECTA. The difference of the platform is that it integrates all these components in a way that can be robust, repeatable and shared across an unlimited number of projects and a big number of European countries and hospitals. The value is creating a platform that first can give us confidence that the quality is going to be the same every time, and also creates a platform that can continue learning throughout consecutive projects, so we always take the lessons for each project and take it through the next one. So we do not miss opportunities and we are more efficient in our delivery. So it has been a fantastic evolution with core labs, core technologies, things we never dreamt of we could do a few years ago, we can do them now. And for the academic user and also the patient, that means that there is more and more data coming back to the patient and to the user. So the complexity and the breadth of the things that we can measure with Inspecta is absolutely phenomenal now and also, I must say, very satisfying from an academic research point of view. What I like in SPECTA is that it has been created by researchers and physicians to better understand cancer, but also to provide the patient a direct benefit that will be a comprehensive molecular profile on his own tumor. SPECTA has been fantastic experience because its agility and its capacity has allowed us to understand the biology of cancer and we are really looking at it as a platform that will continue to push the boundaries of understanding cancer, understanding the cancer cells and therefore pushing further the standard of care for cancer patients.